Hello everyone, this is Monica Joshi for a new Wiz Teach talk today. I'll be explaining you a program today uh, for the login ID and password in uh, NetBeans, Java NetBeans. So uh, our screen looks like this, like if uh, the user is going to fill the uh, user ID IT and the password which I have fed in uh, as a credential and click on submit and uh, if the password will be correct the message alert will come it you have logged in successfully it that is username you have logged in successfully and uh, else i mean like return so i'll be showing you the code as on the small screen if i'm i'll be typing the code won't be clear so i, I have just typed in copied the code here so that it should be visible and then you can see it clearly children uh, so, uh, for uh, doing it in uh, NetBeans, we have to write the function like pri private void and the function's name is, uh, as I am writing on the button, I, the function's name is pwd pfa action performed. This is the name of the function and then uh, in the brackets, this is java.awt.event action event. We are writing on the action event that is avt. And uh, so these slashes are to do add your uh, handling coding here. So these are the comments I have written here. So I have taken a variable uh, whose data type is string and the variable name is pwd. And in that I have stored new, new is, is a signer to that string and pwd pf that dot get password because we want to get the password so the name of the uh, text box is pwd so this the name of this uh, text box is pwd pf i have kept it so i have to get the password in this in this field so i have written pwd pf because this is password dot get password the next is for string name string name is i have named the id field as UIDTF because it's a text field. So the name of user ID field is UIDTF. Then in this also I have to get the text. So dot get text. When we have to get the password, the get password property is used. And when I have to get the text, dot get text property is used. And then now we'll be starting with the if condition. If PWD that is the variable which I have assigned for PWD PF field that and for the ID field text box I have assigned the field name and both the types are string. So if PWD equals to try try again means the password which I enter that will be try try again then you will get a label box message dot label i have taken a label box and then i have set it set its property to text name name means what is this what is coming in this field that is what i am writing here name plus you have logged in successfully that's what it is written name is it whatever will be the username it you have logged in successfully and Else, if it will be a wrong password, then what will come? Name, that is whatever is the username, name is IT. Your and you entered an invalid password, dot either try again or leave. So this I am making, making it as a property. I have written either try again. The message will come be there try again or leave. There will be two buttons. Instead of return, there will be two buttons. That is try again and leave. And alert dot visible. I have set the alerts visible to true. This this is the alert dialog box. So I have written here alert dot set visible is true. And then I have closed the function here because I have started the function here with the curly bracket. And then I have closed the function here. And then again I have written pr private void return button action performed Java dot awt dot event dot action event. And action events alias I have named it as EVT and then alert dot dispose it means we are uh, removing the alert dialog box if uh, when we have to resume then the alerts dialog box will be uh, disposed so this is a way if you have to design a program for the login ID 
and password before starting any of your projects you can have the you should have the screen before starting any of your project screen so i hope the code is clear i am uploading the program code file as well so that uh, this program should be clear to you so this is monica joshi uh, till the next talk signing off thank you so much